Today, you're going to learn how to make this oatmeal body scrub that also foams. The first one you need is oatmeal, the normal oatmeal you have in your kitchen. You just need a cup of oatmeal. Oatmeal can work as an exfoliant that slugs away dirt, oil, and dead skin cells on your skin. It can also moisturize and reduce inflammation. And lots of people use this. They have been using this as a home remedy for dry, itchy, and irritated skin. One thing about oatmeal is that it doesn't is it is not harsh so it does not dry your skin further if you have dry skin originally using sugar scrub can break your skin like using it often so a great option is to use to go for the oatmeal scrub so the next thing you want to do is to grind your oatmeal we need the powdered form and to be frank you can leave it as old but i just feel like grinding it is the best option in fact, doctors like the dermatologists, they recommend people to use oatmeal on their skin because of its great benefits and the gentle effect it provides to the skin. Oatmeal is also a very good option for your face cleansers because it is good for acne and it cleanses the skin really well. It also contains collagen. Now, this is my Abau mixture. In this video, the video, the link of the video will be in the description box. I made this herbal oil. So this is just the remnant. I'm going to tell you what you will do if you don't have this herbal residue or the shaft in a minute. I'm going to tell you what to do. But oatmeal contains collagen. And you know by now, as we are aging, our skin needs more collagen to help with the wrinkles, the sagging of the skin. It is a great option for people that have eczema. Or irritated skin if you have eczema using scented oils or scented body wash or scented scrub might not be the best option so going for oatmeal is a wise option it also offers hydration and moisturization it reduces the skin inflammation and it also makes the skin really smooth so if you don't have the about shaft the residue I used in this video you can just use any abs you can ground your fenugreek powder, grind it, or your grounded flaxseed powder, any other powders, you're good to go. So the reason I'm going to use this body wash, I have this body wash around. So I'm just going to add it in my body scrub just to give that effect of, you know, soapy effect, just to make it foam on the skin. Most of the time, when you make your DIY body scrub, you notice that it is always very oily, at least most of the time it is very oily on your skin and you have to use your soap and your sponge to wash your body after using your body scrub so this is what i wanted to prevent in this video and that is why i'm using the body wash you can use any soap you have so far it is liquid you can't use the the bar soap in this recipe just add your liquid soap to it this is a no measurement like for the soap i mean but for the oatmeal this is just a single use oatmeal you just need a cup of oatmeal and just grind it then add in your grounded seed or herb then go ahead to add in oils a tablespoon of olive oil or just two tablespoons of olive oil if you have any other oil you can make it one tablespoon each the reason i'm not going for that is that um in my residue there is still lots of oil in that residue i used the one i added to the oatmeal so no need for me to put in more oils. So the next thing I'm doing is to just mix my ingredients, the oatmeal, the abel residue or the shaft, and the soap. You want to make sure you use as much soap as you want so that it can form well on your body. And really, it is really gentle to the skin. It's, it just slides through your body. After pouring water on your body, you make your body wet, then you use this amazing body scrub have you liked the video please if you're watching you're still watching till this moment please give this video a thumbs up because that way youtube notice someone likes it then let me send it out to other people please give it a like so youtube can realize that okay if someone liked this video then let me send it out to other people and that way other people can see and watch the video Thank you.
So what I'm just doing next is just the packaging. I'm just transferring my body scrub into a glass jar. This scrub can be used on anyone, even the kids. It does not contain any harsh ingredients. It is safe to use. Actually, I don't post, I do not make videos that are not safe for kids. All my videos are gentle to the skin, to the air. And yeah, we'll just keep it like that. I think that that reserves the name of the channel, Z Natural Care. So make sure you store it in a dried, in a sterilized, cool jar. Dried jar, I mean, one that is not wet. So that you don't your your body scrub does not go bad immediately use this if you cannot finish it just put it in the freezer and use it um the third day you know you should exfoliate your skin three times in a week three or four times in a week so i recommend doing it three times so if you can't finish it store it in the fridge because it does not contain any preservative. So at least that's the most we can do at the moment. Store it in the fridge and you use it up the third day. So that's all for today. This is the end product.